everyone, it's me Olya here, you're welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to learn how to say this and that in Ukrainian. So in English, if you think about it, uh, in order to point at something that's near you, we have these two words. This is for singular and uh, these is for plural. In Ukrainian, for these, for plural, we also have one word. So in order to say these in Ukrainian, we would say ti, ti, ti. For instance, ti dveri, these doors, oh hi my desk, ti studenti, these students, ti mista, these towns or these cities, ti knishki, these books, ti ljudi, these people. For singular, however, we don't have one word, we have three of them. Why? Because in Ukrainian we have these distinctions um, between different genders. So for feminine and uh, masculine and neuter we will have different uh, pronouns, but they are they sound very similarly. So for masculine singular we would have say, say, say. So to say this masculine singular we use the pronoun say. For instance, say rik this year, say den, this day, say telephone, this phone. For feminine singular we would have tia, tia. This feminine singular in Ukrainian is tia. For instance, tia divchina, this girl, tia knishka, this book, tia polichka, this shelf. Neuter singular is se, se. Uh, for instance, se selo, this village, uh, se misto, this town or this city, se imya, this name. Again, to revise, in order to say these in Ukrainian, we have a pronoun ti, ti, ti. And in order to say this, we have three words depending on gender. Se, masculine, se, feminine, and se, neuter. And now let us take a look at how these guys are going to behave when we will take them through cases. In Ukrainian, if you've seen my videos or you know by yourself, we have seven uh, cases for nouns. However, for pronouns we only have six. We don't have a vocative case for um, pronouns and it makes sense if you think about it. Let us begin with plurals, T. So nominative, T, T. Genitive, sich, sich. Dative, sim, sim. Accusative, si or sich, si, sich. We would use si for um, non-living um, objects and sich for living. Instrumental, simi, simi. Locative, sich, sich. Now let's go to singular and let's begin for a change with the feminine. So, tia, nominative, tia, tia, genitive, tieji, tieji, or tseji. You can use both, they are interchangeable. Dative, ti, ti, accusative, tiu, tiu, instrumental. Tieju, tieju, or tseju. Again, interchangeable, doesn't matter. Locative, ti, ti. Masculine, tsei. Nominative, tsei, tsei. Genitive, tsioho, tsioho. Dative, tsiomu, tsiomu. Accusative, tsei, or tsioho, tsei, or tsioho. So you would use say for non-living and tsioho for living. Instrumental, tsim, tsim. Locative, tsiomu, tsiomu. And for neuter, tse. Nominative is tse, tse. Genitive, tsioho, tsioho. Dative, tsiomu, tsiomu. The same like for uh, masculine. Accusative. Se, se, instrumental.
instrumental sim sim and locative tomu tomu let's make some sentences for instance ci ljudi moji druzi these people are my friends in this case we have a nominative case so ci ljudi pojasnite tim ljudjem svoju situaciju explain your situation to these people to whom to these people komu tim ljudjem dative case у цих книжках є багато цікавого. Uh, there is a lot of interesting things in these books. Де у цих книжках locative case. Ця жінка працює у магазині. This woman works in a store. This woman who nominative case. Ця жінка. Цій людині потрібна допомога. This person need, needs help. Кому потрібна допомога? To whom the help is needed? To this person, dative case, кому, цій людині. Я завжди пишу цією ручкою. I always write with this pen. So, with what? Or by means of what? By the means of this pen. Instrumental case, цією ручкою. Я не знаю цього чоловіка. I don't know this man. Я не знаю кого. I don't know whom. This man. Цього чоловіка. Accusative case. Чия це книжка? Цього хлопчика. Whose is this book? This boy's. Цього хлопчика. Кого? Genitive. Я народилася у цьому місті. I was born in this town. Я народилася де? Where? У цьому місті. Locative case. Now, to point at something that's far away from you, or basically to say that or those in Ukrainian we will also have four words one for plurals and um, three for singular so plural those in Ukrainian means ti okay so to say these we would have ti and to say those we would have ti 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 for instance ti krajiny those countries ti ljudi those people, ці люди, these people, ті люди, those people, ті письменники, those writers, ті тварини, those animals, ті книги, those books, these books, those books, ці книжки, ті книжки. Now let's go to singular. Singular masculine is той, той, that, той. So this masculine, цей, but that, той, цей, той. The one that's near, цей, the one that's far away, той. Той день, that day, той будинок, that house, той потяг, that train, той вокзал, that train station. For feminine singular, we have та, та, that, Feminine, ta. So this feminine was ця, still is ця, but that is ta. Ця, ta. That stop, that bus stop, for instance. Ta zupinka. That car, ta mašina. This car, ця mašina. That car, ta mašina. Ta dievčina, that girl. Ta profesorka, that professor. Female professor. Singular neuture for that is te. Te. Singular neuture for this is se, but that is te. Se, te. For instance, that tree, te derevo. That village, te selo. This village, se selo. That village, te selo. Te zavdanja, that assignment. Te zavdanja. Te posilanja, that link. You know, something that you press and which takes you to some other place on the internet. Posilanja. Link. That link, te posilanja. This link, se posilanja. Let's take a look at cases. Let's begin traditionally with uh, plurals. Ti, nominative. Ti, ti, genitive. Tih, tih. Dative, tim, tim. Accusative, ti, tih, ti, tih. Instrumental, timi. Tými, locative, tých, tých, 
Singular masculine. Toy. Nominative. Toy. Toy. Genitive. Toho. Toho. Dative. Tomu. Tomu. Accusative. Toy or toho. Toy. Toho. Instrumental. Tim. Tim. Locative. Tomu or team. It doesn't really matter. Like you can use whichever one you want. Tomu or team. Singular feminine for that is ta. Ta. So nominative. Ta. Ta. Genitive. Tiei or toi. You can use whichever one you want. Tiei. Toi. Dative. Ti. Ti. Accusative. Tu. Tu. Instrumental. Tiei or toyu. Doesn't matter. You can use whichever one you want. Tiei or toyu. Locative. Ti. Ti. Neuter singular for that is te. So nominative is te. Te. Genitive. Toho. Toho. Dative. Tomu. Tomu. Accusative. Te. Te. Instrumental. Tim. Tim. And locative. Tomu or tim. You can use whichever one you want. But more commonly we use tomu. For instance, ti dereba vzeskinuli listja. Those trees already dropped uh, the leaves. Ti dereba, what, što, nominative case. Toj pismenik čudovo piše. That writer writes very well. That writer whom toj pismenik. Ne vykoristovujte tu farbu, kraše vizmiti ož tu. Don't use that paint. Better use this one. Daj jiste tomu košenjati. Feed that kitten. Uh, so, daj jiste komu, to whom, uh, to that kitten, dative case, tomu košenjati. My chodili do školy v tomu selí. We went to school in that village. We went to school where? In what village? In that village. U tomu selí. Locative case. Ja družila s tijejú divčenkoju v školi. Uh, I was a friend of that girl. At school. Ja družila s kim? With whom? With that girl. Instrumental case. Well, that is it for today. I am going to finish my video here. If you still have any questions, please do not hesitate and leave them down below. And before I finish, I want to take a second and say thank you so much to everybody who is supporting my channel on Patreon. It really means a lot. Also, to those of you who are watching, thank you for watching, commenting, liking my videos. It really means a lot and helps me keep going. And I will see you in my next video, hopefully very soon. Bye!